Good morning, or good afternoon, Your Honor. Michael Jones, appearing on behalf of Mr. Serio. Apparently, we've had a mis- or I've had a mis- my office has had a miscommunication with Mr. Serio. He just started a new job, and apparently, that's where he is today. We're asked to continue this. We're trying. To- this matter is on appeal. We filed a, a, a request for a stay from. Uh, the judge, but I don't think he, he may not have seen it yet since he's a pro tem. Right, okay. So if we could set this over until uh, pro tem grant sees that, I'm assuming he'll routinely grant the stay since it's a relatively short sentence to go ahead with it. We would complete the sentence before okay. the appeal. Do we know how this got on this calendar? It's all filed and pending. Oh, because it's an allegation of not complying with the sentence? I'm sorry, I didn't hear you. This is on this calendar, I assume, because the allegation is that he did not comply with the sentence, but you requested a stay. Is that right. Okay. Let's go ahead and set this over. Um, I'm just making sure I don't overset any calendar, so bear with me here. And, and Your Honor, the, I assume counsel can appear on his client's behalf. Today. Certainly. Is that right? The city, Mr. Seria would be statutorily eligible, I believe, for a stay. So we have no objection, you know, based on the state. Well, I, I, I don't want to hear that because it was submitted to Judge Pro Tem Grant. So he's sure. going to need to rule on but that. I, I guess what I'm suggesting is if he grants that stay, there would, we wouldn't need a hearing. Right. That no, I, that office. would be my assumption as well. I my office that they have forwarded to Judge Pro Tem okay. Grant, but... I don't think he's seen it or hasn't signed it and returned it yet. Can we have an impound hearing on the 13th at 9 o'clock? Let's go ahead and put this on 10 o'clock, Monday, September 13th. That can be stricken if Judge Pro Tem Grant grants the stay. And we will note your position for the, the record, Mr. Kamen, so that we have that memorialized. Um, but he's going to just need to have rule on that based under the statute. Thank you, Your Honor. I appreciate it. What was the date again? I just didn't hear. It's going to be Monday, September 13th at 10 o'clock, and we will note that your client is appearing this morning through counsel, or this afternoon. And he is present. He just started a brand new job, though. And so I know he's available. We've been in communication with him. Okay, and then I have the Christopher Crawford matter, which is the city's motion to revoke.